Hi, here's another car seat simulation. We have the vehicle seat on the outside in black, then in yellow, a child seat, which is attached to the vehicle seat by a belt. The belt at a certain distance or greater is, is elastic like a spring. Inside that distance, it exerts no force at all. Then there's a test mass in black again, connected to the child seat. This is by a, a very rigid mechanical connection, so it can't move in or out. Finally, the test mass and the seat are connected by these colliders which are nearly invisible lines that show where a collision force will be imposed if the radius gets to be small enough. So if, if this test mass should come into contact with this part on the back of the vehicle seat then there will be a collision force otherwise not. And we will soon have these kind of lighting up to display where collisions are taking place to help make the results easier to understand. Here go. I'll run the simulation. It takes about 10-12 seconds to run. 14 this time. So here's the, the collision begins and the of course the net acceleration is forward on the child seat and the test mass. This is 100 milliseconds. You can see where it is by this time bar on the bottom. I'm grabbing with the mouse the time bar on the bottom and I can actually move backward and forward through the simulation and watch the time uh, up above the word seat here there's a time indicator. But let me just play the simulation let it run automatically. You can see the loose object sliding forward and finally being pulled back somewhat. Once the acceleration ceases they'd be pulled back considerably. That was a couple more runs there. Thanks for watching.